show you how you can log into things like your Google Classroom by setting up a Google account um, <clears throat> or a guest page um, and then using your college information to get into that account. So I have already got my own personal Gmail um, account uh, saved here and I went here to add and uh, made myself a little uh, guest account called college. Um, I will now have to sign in and that's what I'm going to show you so that you can sign into your college email and Google Classroom. So if I click on Gmail, <clears throat> it's going to ask me to create account, sign in or sign in for work. So I'm going to sign in. And I'm going to use my college Gmail account. Now, if you're a student at Barking and Dagenham College, it will be your student number at g.bdc.ac.uk. Now, for members of staff, it will be their full name. Dot. Some lovely. And then you will come to the BDC Learning Portal, okay? Now here, you don't have to put in your full email, it will just be your student name and your password. So that could be, um, usually it will be one that's been given to you by your tutor that you'll know about when you start the course. Um, you can also change your password with the IT department. So I'm gonna log in now using my college um, information. And this is what has come up. So it's asking me if I want to keep the information. I'm going to say yes. And then I'm going to click continue. <clears throat> Fantastic. It's now logged me in to my Gmail. So I'm going to come out of that so that you can't all see my emails. But now that I'm logged in on my college account, I can access all of these um, Google applications within that account, okay? And of course, one of the ones that will be very important is Google Classroom. So when I click on Classroom, it will automatically send me to the Google Classroom attached to the account we've logged in with. And then here you can see all of my classes. If you have been invited to a class, um, you will have a little join button that you can choose. If not, you can, um, Add yourself to a class so create or join a class you can do join a class and if you just ask your teacher for what the class code is um, you should be able to get into the class that way okay so that's a simple and easy way of getting into Google Classroom and like I said um, when you are creating these different um, accounts on your Google Chrome um, adding a new uh, profile completely will just help to manage <clears throat> what emails you're using and how access uh, how you can get access into things like your Google Classroom or your Gmail okay so I hope that helps